The title of my speech is, uh, what are we doing, right? I, I really like puns. Most people don't know that about me. I really like puns, uh, the changing tides of the Ethereum Foundation grants program. Um, so I, my name is Ken, uh, like Barbie and Ken, like the doll. Uh, that's, that's how you remember me. I send a lot of emails out. Um, but I'm really happy to be on stage today because uh, a lot of what I've heard uh, throughout the weekend is, you know, Ethereum Foundation Grants Program is a black box, right? Like, no one knows who you guys are. You guys are so mysterious. Um, and what else? You guys, you have, a, you have some money, right? Ethereum Foundation Grants Program has a lot of money, uh, sort of. But what we like to do is, is talk through, you know, what are we actually doing here, right? Like, what is the mission of the grants program? And is this actually sustainable, right? So thus far this year, we've given out uh, $11 million to 75 projects, which is not insubstantial. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Um, it's awesome because we were able to bring a lot of people from all around uh, the blockchain industries, right? So it's not just Ethereum, it's not just the community, but it's also bringing people over from Secure Scuttlebutt. It's also bringing people from university, academia, bringing Kestrel Institute, uh, bringing everyone from around the world, and really talking about what it is that the grants program really is trying to do, right? And it's kind of nebulous thus far. Um, this is, I guess, like a face that you see now for the grants program. Um, but there's not just me, right? It's a lot more on the team. Uh, and I don't like saying I, it's, it's more of we. Um, and I'll get back to this, and I'll, I'll do some more puns. This is going to be good. Uh, there, it's like stand-up comedy where you wrap it around at the end. Um, maybe. I don't know. I'm not that funny. Uh, <laughs> but what I think I, I really want to kind of bring out here is, is that, you know, it's this idea that, you know, the Ethereum Foundation Grants Program is really just funding Vitalik's friends, and, like, you know, you guys are just doing whatever you want with all this money, and, like, that would be really cool because, like, that would make my job a lot easier but it's not easy. We're actually talking about, you know, for the grants program, it's fundamentally changing and, and empowering the community. And that's very, very broad, right? What does it actually mean to empower the community? It's talking about funding and empowering open source development, right? It's actually talking about um, creating upon the core infrastructure of Ethereum. And what that means is, is really talking through, you know, public goods, right, public utility, public tooling, what does Ethereum actually need, right? It's actually facing the hard facts of what's broken, right? What, where is our roadmap currently, and how do we build upon that? How do we address the issues head on? And so one of the things that I've, I've really realized in the space is we don't like to talk about what's broken. We don't like to admit our flaws, but that's okay, right? A lot of things are going really well with Ethereum, and that's, that's amazing. Uh, the foundation is going. And it's not just the foundation, it's everyone else in the community. Um, I kind of liken this to, you know, not, we're not really looking for a return on, return on investment, which is what a lot of people ask us, right? It's like, how, is, how are grants actually sustainable if you're not getting ROI? But that's the point of grants. You actually don't need an ROI. What we're looking for here is actually impact, right? Compounding impact. Um, the Ethereum Foundation doesn't have that much money. So if you look at the grants program, we actually have less than 1% of all Ether in circulation, right? It's not insubstantial. We still do have money that we're you know, pumping out into the ecosystem. And we're gonna continue to keep pumping it out. The idea behind this is, you know, what this can really fundamentally do is bring more people to the table. Right? It's not just us sitting here saying, oh, well, that, these guys, like, you guys should get some money, and you guys should get some money. It's really like, how do we bring all of us? Yeah, Oprah style, right? It, I wish it was Oprah style, but it, it's, you know, we, we want to bring more people and, and come to the table and sit with us, right? Don't be afraid to come to me and ask me, can I, can I apply for a grant, right? We actually saw a decline in applications because people were kind of scared and saying, like, you know, like, I don't, we're not even worth it. Like, yes, you are. Absolutely, you're worth it. This is the Ethereum community. Everyone here can apply for a grant, and I will talk to every single one of you. Not just me, but everyone else on this team, on the grants team, we'll talk to you, and we'll make sure that you hear back from us, right? So fundamentally, what we want to do is have everyone here come to the table, because the Ethereum Foundation wants to use this to diffuse our power, diffuse what we have here, all of our resources, and make sure it's disseminated across everyone here, 
right? For the decentralized future to actually exist, it can't just be us at the table. It's every one of us. It's everyone building uh, with client diversity. It's everyone building on security because the experts are out there. The experts are, are all around the world, and it's not just people who say we're a Ethereum foundation, right? It's, it's every one of you guys sitting out here saying, we want to build. Yeah, so let, let us help you build. Let us give you funds. Let us give you resources. Let us bring you to the table. Let us have you talking to everyone else around here. Don't be afraid to do it, right? Just come up. Um, and so now we're going to go back to funds because I'm, I only have three minutes left. Um, so what I like to talk about is, is how what we're doing here is, is, like a, is like a sail. It's like a ship, right? And so what we're doing is really like making sure everyone's sails are up. And we're just pushing wind out at everyone, right? Little by little, we're just going to keep pushing more boats at sea so that we have a full navy out here, right? It's not just one ship. The, the most powerful navy is with the most amount of ships flanking around, right? It's not just one guy at the top. No Christopher Columbus here. And it's still debated when Christopher Columbus. That's actually an American reference. Sorry, I apologize. Uh, very ignorant American. Um, but, you know, like... It's really cool to see teams like Prismatic Labs, right? Um, yeah, woohoo, Prismatic Labs. Woo! Um, where you just kind of meet online, right? You just meet online and just say, like, this is what we want to build. This is our passion project. Let us get a grant and let's build a full team. And they've been able to do that. And then they come back and say, hey, we're, we want to build a client. Absolutely. Yeah, just let's keep doing it. Let's have more people do the same thing. Let's build our passion projects. Let's see where it goes. Let's stop worrying about building, you know, like let's stop worrying about how do we build a business. Let's stop worrying about all these other things. Let's actually build what we want to build. Let's make Ethereum better, right? Let's actually do it. And let us, let us give you the wind so your sales can keep going, right? What are we doing? That's, that's it, man. This is what we're doing. Um, and, but I truly do believe, jokes aside, that you know, through the grants program, um, the decentralized future is really in our hands. It really is. Uh, and we have to understand that using resources, using funds, tap and rely on the Ethereum Foundation and rely on the grants program to let you do that. Because you know, the other question we get asked is, like, who are you to be giving these grants out? Great question. Because the grants team is actually not just us. What we do is just facilitate. We facilitate conversations, right? So all of us go out and reach other people to get on these, um, get on these calls and get on these conversations of who deserves to, be, to get a grant, right? We are not technically the experts of, of everything, right? We don't know everything, right? We get people from outside of the foundation, internal, external, anyone we can get to make sure that what we're doing is fundamentally going to better the ecosystem, right? And that's having these hard conversations of, you know, will this essentially be my competitor? Absolutely. But that's okay, right? It's, it's okay. We have to be able to, to say, like, you know what? I love it. Let's all build together. We can build the same thing, and we can build it better, or we can work together, right? That's even better. This is, this is the Navy right here. We can keep going, right? So yeah, I'm just going to end it with that. Um, let the grants program allow you to put the decentralized future in all of our hands. Thank you, guys.